And with about two minutes, I turned into this little fanboy that just started geeking out. And then I had to show him that I was wearing a Doctor Who t-shirt. Jordan Zachron with Sci-Fi Wire here at New York Comic Con with Dean Devlin, the prolific writer, executive producer, director. Uh, we're talking about the librarians right now and uh, all your other projects. So how are you doing? Good, good. I always have fun coming to Comic-Con. You know, they just released a few days ago the, the new trailer for the season four of Librarians. And so what should people be most excited about for this season? Well, this season is really for the fans. It's for people who've been watching this show. And it becomes much more personal this year. You know, last season, the theme of the season was the consequences of using magic. And this season, it's much more about the consequences of being a librarian. We're going to find out in the very first episode that the library has not been completely honest about the, the whole institution of the library. Oh, dear. I don't like it when he says, oh, dear. And when our librarians find that out, they have to really make a decision whether all their sacrifices they're making is worth it to an organization it starts to have doubts about. So you're sort of going to blow things up right at the beginning. Yeah, well, prophecy is over starting this season because the prophecy uh, up to last season was about the ultimate battle of good and evil. Well, we won that battle, but what we discover is once that battle is over, there is no more prophecy. We are post-prophecy. And so everything starts to become a little bit unhinged. And evil never rests. Evil never rests, exactly. <laughs> you made Stargate so many years ago, they made a TV show, now you're gonna reboot it. And I'm wondering where that is now. I'm actually not involved with the reboot of Stargate at all. So uh, MGM's doing that, uh, I wish them well. But uh, in an ironic twist, uh, uh, while I had done the movie of Stargate, I, didn't, I wasn't involved in the television series. The man who was involved in the television series was Jonathan Glasner. Well, he and I have now teamed up, and we're going to debut a new TV series that we're going to start shooting very soon called The Outpost. And it's a big kind of fantasy world, sword and sandals type of show. We're really excited about it. We're at Comic-Con. Uh, we've worked with so many people, so many famous people, great directors. But is there someone that, if you've, that you've met before that you really geeked out about or you would love to meet and geek out on? Well, I, I just directed a movie, uh, a thriller, and uh, I wanted to cast David Tennant in the lead. And I'm a huge Doctor Who fan, so I couldn't wait to, to meet him. So we, we set up this virtual conference, you know, on Skype. And I was trying to be this sophisticated director with a powerful vision. And with about two minutes, I turned into this little fanboy that had just started geeking out. And then I had to show him that I was wearing a Doctor Who t-shirt. Of course, he pointed out that I had on the logo of the Matt Smith Doctor Who, not him. And so I, I, I had my foot in my mouth. Luckily, he forgave me, and he did the movie. So that was, that was my big fanboy moment. 